Good morning, brothers and sisters. Since our last meeting, I would like to report on arbitrations. City of Woburn, arbitrations decision is expected April 29th. Town of Acton, confirmed hearing date October 2, 2020. St. Michael Cemetery, DLR hearing was postponed due to the state of emergency. Negotiations, Greater Lawrence Sanitary District, we conducted our first session this past week via conference call. Moving forward, I will be contacting all employers to schedule dates to begin negotiations remotely. Layoffs. As a result of the federal stimulus package, nationally, thousands of Gate Gourmet and Axe Aviation members will potentially receive benefits. We are working closely with both companies to ensure we approach the coming months with a primary plan as these federal monies roll out and impact our members. Essential workers, I would like to take some time to highlight the outstanding brothers and sisters who are on the front line. Our certified nursing assistants on the front line caring for our seniors under the most difficult situations at the Next Step Nursing Facility in West Newton. Our brothers who are operators and laborers at St. Michael Cemetery, they are gearing up and have been tasked with significant burials and cremations due to the health crisis. Our certified respiratory therapists at Witten Hospital in Everett, they are initiating and managing life support for acute patients in intensive care units for COVID-19. As you can imagine, many patients are suffering. Our brothers and sisters are holding the line in a very big way. Their only ask is that people make cards, get them to the patients in hospitals and facilities. The greatest tragedy is that patients and seniors are alone. It's amazing, a simple card of love lifts the spirits of all, patients and caretakers alike. City of Chelsea DPW brothers are assisting with efforts coordinated by National Coast Guard, Salvation Army, and other entities to provide emergency relief to the City of Chelsea. East Boston Neighborhood Health Center drivers are providing transportation to senior citizens to required medical treatments, also to nurses who are providing home care for residents, shuttling health care professionals to COVID test sites, in delivering meals to residents in Boston communities. And a final shout out to the emergency telecommunications in the many cities and towns we represent. You truly are the unsung heroes of public safety. In closing, thank you to all our brothers and sisters for your courageous strength and unselfish dedication. Continue to reach out to those in need. Thank you. Joan Corey, Business Agent.